Yo, what is going on guys? It's Cryptic TMG and I'm back with a brand new video. This time we're going to be doing a comparison lap between the old Audi Evo and the new Audi Evo 2. Um, couple of things that I did notice with the, the new Audi, definitely a lot more stable. But I want to see if you guys can pick up on the, the differences between the cars. Both cars drive pretty decent. There is some noticeable differences from my point of view that I'll talk about after the comparison lap. Um, I have got a setup for both cars which I've dropped in my uh, Google Drive folder which you guys can see in the description but anyway let's get stuck into the video and see what you guys think. So we're going to analyze the laps again with the car side by side this time we're going to give you guys a breakdown on where each car has its own strengths um, you can see now through the fast corners is where i really think the audi evo 2 does stand out quite a bit you can see now as we come through magazine beckett's you can just see where it has a little bit of a lead but i wanted to focus a little bit on just as we exit onto the back straight you'll be able to see in a minute where the um the the audi evo 2 sort of has a could be down to setup doesn't ride the bumps as well as we exit onto the back straight and really seems to just be a little bit sketchy over the bumps but again as we come onto the hanger straight you'll see at the end of the straight actually the audi evo 2 is quite a, a bit quicker down the straight and we know that the evo 2 has a bigger rear wing so the old audi is definitely quicker down the straight but again through the fast corners is where i expect to pick up the time with the evo 2 um as we get to this left hand out, you can see the cars are pretty much identical as we turn through that corner. Um, again, on the exit, I just felt as if the, the older Aldo was just a little bit more nimble. It just had a little bit more nimbleness out of the corners, didn't seem to get as much wheel spin. Um, again, as we enter this section, and again, you're gonna see two different profiles in terms of, we actually have to um, slow down and gear down in the, in the old Audi whereas the, the new Audi you see it now tends to carry more speed for the corners you don't have to go down as uh, to fourth gear you stay up in fifth and you can just see where it carries more speed for the corners it's actually gained some time back on the uh, on the old Audi and it, it's pretty tricky because I feel like it would be perfect if the, the new Audi had the exact same gear ratios or, or, or something or power as the old Audi because that's why I feel like it, it still lacks a little bit as we come to the bridge you can see now the old Audi actually has a clear lead now a couple of attempts ahead and um yeah as I said it's going to be pretty tricky to you know 
for people to pick the, the newer Audi knowing that they just it just doesn't have a, a big enough edge I feel um, and it is, it's quite noticeable the straight line speed as well and as we come towards the end of the lap you guys can see the free temps and um, yeah it's just I don't, I don't know man I don't know how to feel um, personally I, I would still like to see a little bit more improvements as we get to the finish line and you guys see the lap times there. So as you can see from the comparison, the old Audi is still slightly quicker and it's something that I've noticed. I did actually test it on another track as well. I tried Paul Ricard and definitely the old Audi was quicker. Um, for me, the things that I take away, the things I've noticed is the new Audi Evo definitely a lot more stable through the fast stuff. It seems to have a little bit more um, more of a leeway so if you if you go into a braking zone and you just miss your braking a little bit and you turn a little bit late it's not as pitch sensitive doesn't want to throw you into a spin like the the old audi but the old audi definitely has a lot more straight line speed um it's i did notice with the gears as well although i was shifting at the same rpm it seems as if the old audi gets there quicker as if there's a bit more a bit more power in the engine i'm not too sure if that's the case but for sure if you look at my my gears um side by side you'll see i'm definitely shifting earlier with the older audi um the new one as i said it feels better through the fast stuff I, it did have a little bit more trouble over the bumps and on corner exit between second and third gear there was a, a bit more wheel spin i felt with the the new audi evo um my wish is that they 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 probably are going to need to buff the new audi because you know, if, it, if it's not quicker, there's no real outstanding reason to pick it over the the old one, you know. So um, I would think they might need to buff it just a little bit or at least give it the same sort of gear ratios and, and power that the older one has. Um, other than that, I, you know, I really do. I enjoy driving it. It feels very nice to drive, very stable. But I do feel like they're going to have to give it a bit more um, of an edge on the older car because especially at the top level in esports sort of level there's really no reason to drive the new audi at the moment um if you're if you're looking for pace if you're looking for enjoyment the car feels great as i said before but um yeah that's my takeaway from it guys i hope you guys uh like the video try it yourself and see what you come up with anyway it's crypto tmg like and subscribe hit the notification bell to catch my videos first and peace